Hello, Sonoma County. Welcome back to our channel, or welcome if this is your first time following along. What are buyers looking for in a home here in Sonoma County? Are you thinking of selling? And if you are, follow along today because I'm gonna talk about 12, yes, 12 kind of items, amenities, that are so important that we've learned from helping buyers that are moving into Sonoma County or even buyers moving around Sonoma County that they like to see in their home. But first, I'm Julie Sullivan with Sullivan Group Real Estate. And like I just said, we help people move in and out and all around Sonoma County every year. So stay tuned. Let's talk about the 12 things that are so important to buyers when looking at homes here in Sonoma County. All right, number one, the views. We've got to talk about the views. Sonoma County is just so picturesque with the rolling hills and the vineyards and the ag properties. I mean, you don't go very far, even driving around in, in the county without seeing these beautiful landscapes. So views or just a pretty landscape are important. Now budget, there's gonna be personal preferences and then budget is going to determine how many of these 12 <laughs> items you get. But I think that's pretty high on everybody's list is if you got something pretty to look at, that house is probably moving up a little higher on the lists of potentials. And then speaking of views in our beautiful landscapes, I think number two has to be outdoor living spaces. We have so many days of beautiful weather here that we live outside a lot. You know, grilling and outdoor patios and just areas to entertain outside our home is such a common place here. If we don't have to be inside, we're not inside here in Sonoma County. So everyone really loans a backyard big enough to at least entertain, if not even larger to maybe accommodate some playground area or a pool or some veggie boxes to grow some vegetables or maybe a little place for some chickens or a dog run. So outdoor space is super important here in Sonoma County as well. Number three on the list. Again, this is only important if you have children but definitely when it's a family moving in or around into or around Sonoma County, they are very concerned about the quality of schools and they wanna know where are the best schools? What are some of the best neighborhoods to live in that I'm gonna be able to get my kids into those schools? So I think overall we have very high quality schools across Sonoma County, but there are some differences between them all. And depending on what type of education is important to you, we can help point you in different directions. We've also done some videos on some of the top schools by some of the school rating websites. You know, we kind of combed through those and put together a good list of some of the top schools in, some, in all of the different cities. So you can check that out as well. But, but quality schools and quality education, of course, are forefront when a family is moving in or around Sonoma County. Another item high on the list, and again, you know, it's, this is a personal preference and probably depending on where you're coming from, but I find it interesting that people coming from maybe the Greater Bay Area where they're just used to everything being right at their fingertips and you don't go far and they're shopping and, and doctors and just any of the amenities you would need and they're coming up here and you know, we are a bit of an ag county still, not a bit. We are definitely still an ag county with all of our grape growing and there's still a lot of uh, livestock and so on up here. So proximity to amenities is a question we get a lot. And I think one of the great things, and unless you're living way outside of our main cities on like a country property, our amenities are all pretty close. I recently had this one gentleman who's just in love with Healdsburg. You know, he loves Healdsburg. His budget isn't gonna quite afford him Healdsburg. And I told him, it doesn't matter. Like if you're in Santa Rosa, you're 15 minutes to Healdsburg. I'm in Santa Rosa. We go up to Healdsburg all the time to the wonderful restaurants and their charming downtown. So our whole county is pretty easy to get around. In their center of their cities, there's all the amenities you need. And then countywide. And now kind of getting back to the house features itself. Another fun feature that people love to see is wine storage. And it's really kind of funny because a lot of times people actually moving into the county don't know they are going to need wine storage because they don't even know that they're like wine aficionados yet because they may not be, but they will become that way. But a lot of times people moving around Sonoma County, maybe out of their first home into the next home. It doesn't even have to be a whole wine cellar. But we see in a lot of houses some really cool wine kind of built in all glass in the dining room where the doors open and it's got the wine storage down like the back wall of a dining room. Just super cool feature and it 
very architectural and just kind of very wine country-esque, of course. And then the big wine fridges that are built into dining rooms or living room, kitchen and family room combo areas. We'll see the wine fridges, tall ones, the short ones. And then we've seen a lot of really cool conversions, like, like the under the stair coat closets or just little nooks in houses that people have built out to become some really cool wine storage. So it is funny that wine storage does get brought up often enough that I had it make the list. Another home feature that is getting more and more popular, of course, is people are looking for green builds. You know, a very energy efficient uh, with their appliances, with their lighting, battery chargings for your cars and solar panels. Again, we get so many days of sunshine up here, you guys. You are just an energy producer if you get some solar panels on most homes here in Sonoma County. So. Those are really big features and big selling points here is any kind of green efficiency and ways to reduce the power output and load and reduce your pg e bill. So that's a big one here right now. And I think along the same lines as the green features, the energy saving features, are the smart home features, you know, with security systems and high tech wiring and lighting systems and remote control that you can turn things on remotely with your phone before you even get home. Those are really, really high on the list, especially for our tech savvy buyers. Another feature in these homes that is often sought after are like flex spaces or spaces for home offices with more and more folks working remotely, either full-time or part-time, or the kids homeschooling and homework places. Uh, that's a really, really important feature that they have somewhere where they can set up their home office and be able to have that flexibility with, with work, jobs, kids, homework, however, and it can all just seamlessly work well without sitting on your living room couch, your family room couch, <laughs> trying to get your work done for the day. Then, another big, feature with people spending more time at home and the beautiful scenery and the sunlight we have. Buyers up here really look for homes with big windows or a lot of light in the house. I walk into some houses with some buyers and that's the first thing they say is, oh, this house feels dark. So when you're listing your home, open the windows, clean the windows, make it feel as light and bright as you can because that is a super important thing to buyers coming here in Sonoma County. They want to let that sunlight in. And as many days that we do have sunshine, and I'm, it's going to sound like I'm kind of contradicting myself, but I'm not. We do get our seasons here, okay? We have spring, summer, fall, and winter. Today I am filming this video in February and I'm looking out my windows and it's a beautiful blue sky and a sunny day, but it's not warm. It's not hot out by any stretch. So we do still like our fireplaces here in Sonoma County. And there is a ban on wood burning fireplaces if you're building a new home. But if a home comes with a wood burning fireplace, you are still allowed to use it. So wood burning fireplaces are big. And then in a lot of our new build homes, they have the most beautiful electric fireplaces. There's a lot of them are so sleek and modern and just gorgeous. And they still give you that ambiance. Some of them even do push out heat, which is kind of fun as well. You can warm your room and still have that glow of a fire. So we do like our fireplaces up here in Sonoma County because we do have fall and winter. I think one other feature of homes here in Sonoma County that make it so appealing is yes, we have our cookie cutter subdivisions, but so many of our homes have so much character and charm. I mean, there are homes here in Sonoma County built from early 1900s through current day. And not often do you find those cookie cutter homes. They do exist. We do have some of those neighborhoods and subdivisions that were built up over time, but buyers here really look for homes with character. So find a way to showcase a little character in your home and, and make it look unique and make some unique features like that wine closet, you know, for storage, for wine storage, or, you know, just how you purpose some of your rooms is could really set your home apart from other homes because uniqueness really scores high with buyers looking in our area. So yes, preferences can vary widely with buyers. Everyone's going to be looking for a different thing depending on where they are in their life, what their budget is, where they're coming from, what their dream is for their home here in Sonoma County. But as a seller, I think the point of all of this is just highlight everything you have and you can in your home. Spruce up that backyard and just make it look like the most inviting place that people want to come and hang out with. You know, get that grill area looking really good. That's a huge, huge thing here in Sonoma County. And, you know, inside, just like I said, highlight the best features of your home. And we can help you do that. 
you know, we come in when you're getting ready to sell your home, we're gonna come in with a fresh set of eyes. We're not emotionally attached to your house. We're seeing it clearly and objectively, not emotionally. So um, we can kind of help. we we'll give you some pointers and give you some suggestions of things that we see and that we think can really help highlight those best features. And we also have a whole checklist of home listing prep list of different things to just kind of go through and check out, check off and take a look at and make sure you clean. And like I said, the windows, that's such a huge thing. And um, we can help you with all of that. So reach out. We'd love to get you that list. Go ahead and put a little message down there and uh, we'd be happy to send that your way. Happy to chat with you about helping you get your home looking its very best before you stick that sign in the ground and sell. So I hope you enjoyed this. I hope this helped give you a little idea of what buyers are looking for. If you liked this video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. We release new videos every week highlighting different things about Sonoma County and Sonoma County real estate. And if you ding that bell, you'll even be notified when new videos are dropped. So thanks a lot for watching and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.